Time once again for the Q100 Sports Report. I'm Kevin Smith. This is WFLQ FM, French Lake, Indiana. Taking a look once again at the NFL scores from Sunday. It was New Orleans 17, Minnesota 16, Chicago 13, San Francisco 3, the New York Jets 26, New England 3, Tampa Bay 33, Houston 24, Washington 28, Philadelphia 24, Cleveland 41, Baltimore 23, the Rams 41, Buffalo 17, the Raiders 27, the New York Giants 12. It was San Diego 31, Denver 7. The Chargers just regained the services of Dan Fouts. And it was Seattle 51, KC 48 in OT. And it was Atlanta 47, Green Bay 41 in OT. Tonight, Cincinnati plays at Miami. Game time, 9 p.m. It can be seen on ABC. There will be a Thursday night football game this week when the Raiders play at San Diego. That, again, will be on ABC at 9 o'clock Thursday. Tonight in the NBA, it's Portland and Kansas City. Winners from last night's action were Indiana, Boston, Cleveland, and the Los Angeles Lakers. One National Hockey League game tonight. Vancouver will play at the New York Rangers. There were no games scheduled Sunday night. And Toronto won their first ever Grey Cup championship in the Canadian Football League on Sunday with an 18-17 victory over British Columbia. In golf this weekend, Arnold Palmer and Gary Player recaptured the glory of an earlier era as they won the Skins game between Palmer, Player, Tom Watson, and Jack Nicklaus. Player was the overall winner with $170,000 won. That include $150,000 on a single hole. Palmer finished with $100,000 winnings. Jack Nicklaus had $40,000 winnings for the two days. Tom Watson finished with $10,000 for this weekend's performance. Indiana University soccer team advanced to the Final Four this weekend with a 2-1 to victory over St. Louis in Bloomington. The win extended IU's unbeaten streak to 23 games, and the Hoosiers will be attempting to repeat their NCAA championship of last year. World heavyweight boxing champion Larry Holmes must defend his title against top-ranked contender Greg Page of Louisville or retire undefeated, according to World Boxing Council President Jose Suleiman, who announced that on Sunday. Frazier last Friday made quick work of Marvis Frazier, the son of Joe Frazier, as he ended that round with just three seconds left in the first round. There will be a girls' basketball game tonight at French Lick when Salem plays at Springs Valley. The Lady Hawks are 1-2 and two on the year. After having won last weekend for the first time, they defeated Southridge on Tuesday night. Of course, in college basketball this weekend, Kentucky beat Louisville and Miami of Ohio beat Indiana. Tune in to Q100 Sports Report. Time Out Sporting Goods in West Baden is now open for business. Visit Time Out Sporting Goods for Converse shoes, baseballs, footballs, volleyballs, soccer, golf, all the popular sports items. And Time Out can order any special item of sporting goods or clothing through their catalog. Time Out is your place to go for pro shop white and colored golf balls, trophies, or special order silk screening for sports clothing. Take some time out to visit Time Out Sporting Goods next to Mueller's on the Boulevard in West Baden. Phone 936-4613. Open weekdays at 4.30 p.m. and 10 a.m. Saturdays. Time out. Oh,